Hi guys, this is a continuation of the Canon XA40 camcorder uh, functionalities and uh, today I want to uh, experiment uh, with the low light ca capabilities of this uh, camcorder. On uh, the YouTube uh, I was able to find some low light uh, videos uh, that were supposedly shot with this camera but it really did not give me a good idea of uh, exactly how much light there was, uh, the, the ambient light, uh, the amount of it or anything. And so I thought uh, maybe it would be helpful if I uh, figured out a more methodical way of determining how much daylight, uh, how much uh, ambient light uh, was available. And uh, at first I thought, okay, maybe I should uh, uh, do a measurement of the, the light amount uh, available and then uh, just specify that or mention it uh, in the video. But um, after thinking about it uh, for a while, I uh, decided that uh, not everybody would be able to relate to that and not everybody has a, a light measuring equipment. So. I thought that uh, that's not a very good uh, way to do this uh, for general consumption. So uh, what I have decided to do is I am going to shoot the exact same uh, uh, scene uh, with, the, uh, with my camera but at different times and I'm going to mention exactly what time of the uh, day it is. And, uh, so uh, we can see as the amount of ambient light changes uh, uh, and uh, then uh, we can see how capable uh, this uh, camcorder is for recording the low light uh, situations. And uh, so right now at the beginning of this uh, uh, recording it's 5 p.m. Uh, in my location. It's uh, bright uh, sunlight and no clouds in the uh, in the sky and uh, you are looking at the uh, at a scene from my backyard and uh, i plan to come back uh, roughly once every hour or so uh, of course uh, as we get closer to 6:30, 7 o'clock when uh, we have sunset um, maybe i will increase the uh, frequency of uh, making these recordings uh, and uh, hopefully together we will be able to discover uh, the capabilities of uh, low light uh, shooting with this camcorder. And at the end of the uh, this series of videos, uh, I hope to have a surprise as well uh, that I will reveal towards the end of uh, the series. For the time being, here's the 5 p.m. Uh, recording and uh, I will pick up here in about an hour or so. Okay guys, uh, I'm back and uh, this is the next day actually. Yesterday I wasn't able to make it back uh, in time for uh, sunset time. So right now it's uh, 7.19 which is uh, right at sunset uh, basically. Um, I think my sunset is 7.18 uh, according to, the, uh, to this app that I have. So yeah, this is what it looks like at uh, sunset exactly and uh, I will come back here in another 20 minutes. I think it's going to get dark faster. So I would like to increase the frequency of these recordings uh, so that uh, you would have a better idea of uh, what uh, the low light recording looks like uh, when, um, as, uh, as it is getting dark. So I'll be back in about uh, 15 to 20 minutes. Alright guys, so now it's around 17 minutes uh, after sunset um, in the backyard. And from the screen I can't exactly tell um, how good the quality of low light uh, recording is, uh, but uh, I will review it here. Uh, uh, when I take it to the big screen later but um, so yeah uh, this is what it looks like about 17 minutes after sunset and uh, 
um, I will come back in another 10 minutes or so, maybe 15 minutes, to see how that goes. And here we are, 30 minutes past sunset, it's 7.48. And um, that's what it looks like. I think we are just about pushing the limits of how good this thing can work in low light. And um, so yeah, that's uh, what it looks like. About 30 minutes past sunset. And I know the sky looks pretty bright in here, but it's really not that bright uh, for some reason I don't I'm not sure it's making this camera is making the sky look a lot brighter than it really is <coughs> and here I want to turn on I'm going to turn on my uh, little spotlight to see the difference that makes once This is a light that I have bought for uh, taking videos at night time or in the dark. So let's see how that looks and I will introduce the light uh, later. Is that getting better? Oh, not bad. I think, yeah, it is showing some more detail in the yard pretty good. This is with the light at the floor level, so I'm going to gently raise it, see how that changes things. And yep, there we are. So this light is Viltrox model number L um, yeah it's L one one six T model number of it it allows you it has uh, it allows you to reduce the percentage of the light with a knob so it's not a simple on off you actually have control over it which is very nice i appreciate that and so now i am going to experiment with something else let's see how that works hopefully i can make it work i'm going to turn off this light first So now here we are with infrared, we are about 40 minutes past sunset, it's quite dark, 
and uh, this is what things look like with the, in the infrared mode with the infrared light on. And I believe earlier I did manage to take some video without the infrared light on. But let me double check that, see if I can turn it off and see the difference here. recording I'm uh, unable to turn off the light so I would have to stop recording turn off the light and then turn it back on so here we go okay we're back and now it is recording in infrared mode but with the infrared light off there's a slight bit of uh, light coming from behind the camera here, which is the small light that I have turned on inside the room, but uh, I don't think that's very significant right now. It definitely is not making a big difference. Okay, so this is the end. And I will add some more detailed information and post these. Hope you like it. Please remember to like and uh, subscribe. If you have any comments, please uh, uh, leave me some comments. If uh, you think that uh, this method of demonstrating uh, low light uh, capability was, was useful or if you have any suggestions to make it even better, uh, please don't hesitate to leave a comment for me. And uh, yes subscribe uh, and uh, push the like as well as the uh, bell icon so that you you'll be notified when I post more videos thank you and see you in the next video